you are stuck here. <clears throat> Do you understand what's going on yet? You have to be locked in this realm with a lot of people that don't know sh shit, that don't know nothing, that don't even know they're in the Matrix. Isn't it crazy? Isn't that crazy that there's people that's here that don't even know they're here? Isn't that crazy? That is crazy to me. Welcome to this hyper computer system. Saturn realm matrix. Welcome. Only thing I want to tell y'all is that y'all got to open up y'all third eye in this system that you are in. No, no, no. If you want to have the menu to life, to be able to like press star while you're in a video game and look at the menu and then go all the way down in the menu and go to the options, you have to have your third eye open. Y'all don't understand. I've been able to communicate with the spirits. That's not the new thing. That's not new. That's... I had that gift for a while now. Like I said, the things that y'all worry about, they're worrying about the wrong shit. You're worrying about the wrong shit. Some people is just programmed to the simulation. Some people, some people are here to just feel that pain. Do you understand? You got to watch them be in pain. That's, now that's for real. That's something that's true about this shit. So what I want y'all to learn, angels, this knowledge right here that y'all know, this is all secret shit. This is all shit that is going to make your life easier. All you got to do is go to the playlists. Run the videos. Run the videos at nighttime while you're sleeping. Because I got a lot of videos coming up that it's like God just want me to put this stuff out. Like some some of it is going to be opening mind knowledge like cities of gold, like that video. One day, all of this shit will be classic art that, that people will just won't be able to believe that, wow. I did not find this earlier. But the first people to find this shit is just like, I know God had y'all alive and destined for greatness. Because now you got this. This is like having a genie, uh, a genie lamp. An iPhone is like having a genie lamp. And you could just summon this video anytime. The phone is a portal. But guess what? Everything you see him right now is not real. Me making this video right now is not real. My teachings is basically, I'm not even a teacher. I'm not a teacher. I'm not a teacher. I'm God's angel. I'm one of his angels, that's all. But see, I know where I came from. That's the thing, I know where I came from. Y'all don't know where y'all came from. Y'all don't know if y'all was an animal last time or just straight purgatory blackness. Because you got to understand when you die, it's not, it's not, it just goes, it clicks into a whole nother, it's a whole, go read the African religions. Go read about the Egyptians. They tell you that in the, in the underworld, when you go and you become the soul part of your body, you're you are now 
going to be chased down until you get to the heavens. You will be chased. You won't have no time to be able to. Time don't exist. So who knows how long that chase is going to feel like. You are a eternal being. You are a spiritual being. Y'all got to understand that religion, it was made to trap you. It was made to make you come back here. That's all. That's all. When I look at the earth and I look at the way religion looks, in a way it reincarnate it like actually reincarnates y'all perfectly back. So even if I mean like if y'all live a perfectly good life, y'all still don't go to heaven. If you live a perfectly good life and you're in a religion, you still ain't going to heaven. That's what I'm saying because you're attaching your energies to all types of energies. You're a legionary. You're not an angel. Well, let me tell you something. Because I got to let y'all know, the people that's following this page, they was angels. They was. Even the ones that still eating a little bit of meat. They know they trying to stop. I could, I could feel everything that's going on in the world. I am, I'm a psychic. Like, I'm not, no, I'm not on psychic medium. No, I'm straight up psychic. Straight up psychic. Straight up psychic. No one is about to rain. I can know your thoughts. I could, I'm telling you. That's why I can't hang around a lot of people. Because if I get around people, then it kind of interferes with my universe. Because I'd be meeting random people and I could hear their thoughts in my head. Like, see, I don't know nothing about that. But I also could turn it off, too, and kind of like just mute the shit. But I like to rock around spiritual. If I can't be myself and be spiritual around motherfuckers, I don't want to be around them. Y'all gotta understand. If y'all in a religion, y'all still going to hell. Because y'all gonna come back here because this is basically hell. You can make it a heaven if you become a 100% vegan. It's going to feel like heaven. Every day it's going to feel like you're just going to be grateful every day. That's it. You're going to be grateful every day. You're going to look at the color of trees and be like, wow, that's a nice color. Or that flower is very pink. Like, you're going to really see shit. Like, y'all got to understand. Y'all got to stop thinking I'm mean. I'm not. I don't, I don't know where y'all get this shit from. Like, y'all think that. Y'all y'all just think, you know what? I, you know what I think? I think God is mean. That's what I think. I think he's mean. You know why? Because if y'all don't do what the fuck y'all supposed to do, y'all in a lot of trouble. Y'all in a lot of trouble. Like I told you, the reincarnation system, that shit looked like a fucking bottle of oil being poured right into a funnel going into the engine. The earth is the engine. The souls is the oil. You get it? Like, that's how y'all look. Y'all gonna, y'all scooping yourself right back down here. And I told you, that's where the pain at is for the angels. Because it's like almost impossible to save this world. That's why I said, the people that was coming down here to help, they was coming to scoop a lot of souls to come back to help. So y'all gotta start, y'all gotta start passing this message on. But y'all gotta pass it on. Like, even if you think it ain't for you, still pass it. Because somebody's in your life that you're supposed to help, and then they're going to come back around and help you. It might be years later, but this person is going to get back in your life, and you're going to be like, yo, you remember that 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 page you passed? Yeah, man, I've been listening to it for the last couple of years, and yo, I've been following up, and my life been crazy. Like, everything been just happening good for me. Law of Attraction been working extra good. I've been lighting candles, lighting incense, doing some magic. And that's when your life is good. No stress, no aggravation. Like, you need to focus on you. Like, everybody that's in their in the body, focus on yourself. You have to. You have to. You have to. When you, when you chill with other people or you get on Facebook or Instagram all day long, you're giving your energy away. This whole world is all about having space. Y'all made phones, that's an illusion of space. What do they charge you for every time you buy something? They charge you for the space. So don't hang around. If you already eat meat, definitely don't hang around people that's eating meat because you're trying to stop. See me, I can hang around whoever I want. I can hang around meat eaters and all of that because I'm not going to want to eat it. 
that shit don't look appetizing. So, you don't understand. A phone is an illusion of space. When you're looking in your phone, you think you're looking into different spaces. Same thing with your regular eyes. You think you're looking. No, your soul is looking. Your soul is the one that's looking. Your soul is high right now. This life you in is your soul being high. This is just a big ass DMT trip. Like this is really a dream. Like you gotta, once you skirt and really open your mind and you know this shit is a dream, you're gonna be like, wow, this is crazy because it's hard for a program mind to wrap their mind around that. It's, it's, it's hard. Like, a program mind cannot... It's hard. It's real hard for a program mind to understand that part of life. But that's the easiest part of life, and that's the best part. That's when you know that time is an illusion. Everything in your past is a radio signal. Right now, this silence that you hear... Or whatever, whatever you hear, whatever sounds you hear, man. That's what's happening right now. That's real. That's existing in the moment. But it's not real because it's going to go by. But it exists. But after it's in the past, it's a radio signal. We are signals. We are in a dimension where we are dense down. We're in a dimension where our atoms move so slow that we can actually sit there and hold a cup and drink and sip tea. That's how slow this, that this realm is heavy. This realm is heavy. The spiritual realm, it, it, there's no, there's no weight. Like there's like weight, like this shit is light. Like every, you could do everything you do here with light there and it feels the same way. Like it be raining light. Like, if you, you chilling, yo, I can't go to, y'all ain't gonna understand that. So, like I said, y'all came from light. When a star exploded, you know, that's why y'all don't remember. Because shit like a star exploding and you being with it, nigga, when a firecracker go off, you almost forget what the fuck happened. <laughs> y'all don't understand, y'all mind work the same way on each level. Each level, each dimension. That's what I'm saying. Like, dimensions is... Huh, Y'all don't understand. Y'all don't understand how connected this earth is with the whole universe. Yeah, we, we, we might be little. We might be... We're one of a kind. Y'all don't understand. This earth is one of a kind. And it's crazy how separated we is. Like, if you go to the gas station, everybody on each pump is going to be, like, not trying to talk to each other. That's just how it is. Especially when you're in, like, a city area or some shit like that. Like, y'all don't understand. You're supposed to, every person you see, you're supposed to be able to talk to them and help them out. Oh, you need you need me to help you carry that bag? Oh, you need me to? But, no. No. Not in this world. Not, not, not in this world. Because we in hell right now. If we wasn't in hell, everybody would be able to just walk into anybody's house and be like, yo, I'm coming in there real quick. Yo, I got to use the bathroom or I'm going to get a snack. Everybody should be able to just pretty much <coughs> <coughs> go anywhere. This So this world is about space. And space is really an illusion. But everything is about space. It's broken down from this world to continents, to countries, to states. To counties and cities. To houses. And then you got businesses and everything else that want to be there. This world is no... It, we are so intertwined and we cut down the trees to put cement up. That's what we did. All these cities that y'all see, used to, they didn't used to be buildings. Every... This shit, from outer space, this shit looked like a virus growing on the planet. 
the buildings, like the buildings, all that, that shit look like a disease on earth. Like that shit look like, <clears throat> that shit look like a molded apple. Like basically like some of the earth is mad hard and some of it is green and fresh looking and then some of it is watery. The hard part looks like the disease. Cause this shit supposed to only be green and blue and white when it's snowing on it. So y'all gotta understand when y'all when y'all able to astral project, y'all gonna look at this shit and be like, wow, this shit is crazy. Like parallel universes and all that shit is real. It's real. The scientists, I'm gonna tell you the truth. The scientists don't even know it yet. They right now, we in 2019, and the scientists don't even know that parallel universes is real. They're just throwing it out there as a guess. Like most of the shit that these scientists is telling y'all right now. A lot of it is guessing, but most of it is right because they're getting close. They already got to the point where they split an atom open and realized that it was an energy wave in there. Nothing will ever sit still on this earth. This shit is moving. So that means down to the very little atom, this shit is moving. That's why I try to tell y'all, when you came out, your parent, you woke up in a dream. This shit wasn't real you can have the most fun that you have in your life you could be mayweather spending millions and millions of dollars but you're not real this is a simulation you want to be simulated again you want to come back to the matrix again because that's why I got a lot of my powers now. Like, there is other people that got powers. Y'all just don't believe it. Like, there's other people that are spiritual teachers, and they tell you, yo, I'm like Jesus, or I'm like this. Not, not Jesus, but you know what I mean. Like, they say they're a prophet, or they're God's angel. Or, like, there is people that's really angels, and they will never be really... Maybe a little bit more in the future. Like five years from now, this spiritual shit right here is going to be crazy. Like all the videos that I'm doing right now, like y'all going to, after y'all third eyes crack open, because it's about to be a cycle where everybody's third eyes has to be open. Like you can't even be in this dimension. You're going to have to open your shit. That's what I'm saying. That's the trick right now. That's the rapture. Because when it forces everybody, their eyes to open, the people that are still eating meat are definitely going to see demons. So they're going to do crazy shit. They're going to hear voices. They're going to... See, when you have a third eye open and you are a person who's eating just fruits and you're not, you're eating light souls. See, dead shit is dark souls. Dead shit leave your aura with dark holes in it. My aura is shot right now. My aura is silver. Silver and like a light tan gold. But right now my aura is. Come on. My aura, Ralph Smart. I ain't even eat breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? Real shit. That's, that's what type of shit I'm on. And it's like probably. Four o'clock in the afternoon. I eat a couple fruits and keep it moving. You don't gotta eat all the time. Y'all be thinking y'all gotta eat all the time. You are an angel. You don't have to eat all the time. There's people in this world that don't eat. There's people in this world that only drink water. <clears throat> Lay down in the grass and get sunlight. The niggas don't wanna do nothing. Like I told you, there be Buddhist monks. There be Buddhist monks. On top of mountaintops, melting snow around them because their mind is so strong, they tell itself they're hot and they'll melt their surrounding. That's how strong their mind is. So when you open your third eye, it's not demonic. It's not demonic. And all the shit that we all, if you see the occult, see, y'all let the TV, the TV ruined it for everything. The TV make everything look like it's something else. That's why y'all believe the wrong shit. They they could put anything. They could put anything on a TV right now. They could say a boat crashed and 
it sunk and then rose all the way back up and then drove to the shore. And y'all gonna believe it because they could just make it look like they could put any kind of movie film on the fucking news and y'all believe it. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta open up your fucking third eye. You don't need, you don't even, when you open up your third eye, you don't even need your regular two eyes no more. Them shits just for like regular shit. Them shits just to go get a drink out the fridge. Real shit, them, like, the, when you in your third eye, you are in control of everything that's going on in your life. Yeah. You got to understand, they coming out with all these movies for y'all, so y'all don't open up your fucking eyes. They want y'all programmed. They love y'all weak. They love it when y'all programmed. They love that. Now, hopefully, you will pass this shit on to somebody else so they could get on a program. I'm not talking about, oh, you got to get out of Babylon. And, you know, I'm not talking over that. I'm talking about open up your mind. Because when you open up your mind, you ain't got to worry about where you at. You know where you are. And you know what your mind is. Once you know what your mind is, you know how to use it. See, this body, y'all don't even know how to use it yet. Y'all wake up and go to work for other people. Y'all wake up, go to work, and make somebody else's business bigger. Why do you think McDonald's got so many McDonald's? Because everybody want to work there. Why y'all want to work there? Why you can't? Why you could do the same thing McDonald's doing. Won't all y'all leave McDonald's and make your own McDonald's? Won't y'all do that? Won't y'all do that? Start off with start off with the fucking food stamp card, buying burgers. Sit out in the park, sell them shits, make signs, and then I guarantee you, if you keep doing that shit, you'll be able to buy a building. That's just how the way the universe works. You gotta plant seeds. You gotta plant good seeds. And understand in life that ain't nobody gonna give you shit. Because the people that was here knew they wasn't going to be here. Do you get it? The people in the past don't give a fuck about this shit. But we need to give a fuck about it. Because that's why we are where we are now. Because the other people didn't give a fuck. So just understand in life that everything ain't going to be easy. But if you open up your third eye, you can make shit easy. Shit will get real easy when you can see shit clearly. Clearly. 